And so who am I with today? Oh yeah, because my family is in the My representative. St. Paul. Because they don't want to be right here in my community. So yeah, so our city. Well, and we're so glad to have you. I'm excited. I'm having a gas. I'm just really resource about training and what I like to do is to make a community. So little events like this. Exactly. And food is one way to connect the community. Exactly, and so let, and that's what the community meal is about. As we do these little dinners that are leading up to it, and so we're collecting food stories. Also, a collect uh, uh, an excuse for me to collect food stories. And so I'm asking people, guests here, there a, a favorite food store that can have something to do with your favorite dinner time conversation or argument or. Uh, or your favorite meal, or what was the favorite thing you remember your mother or grandmother making, or where you learned to cook. All of those are things that can spur a food story. Okay. Um, wow. Um, I, I think my biggest food story, most memorable food story, come from Thanksgiving. Uh, okay. Thanksgiving holiday, oh, yummy yeah. days where we just cook and cook and cook and <laughs> eat and eat and eat. Uh, and so I had a mother who loved Thanksgiving as I do now, uh -huh. you know, for a couple of reasons. But it is definitely a time where family come together. We eat, oh, shoot, I might have uh, to laugh. Because I'm on my bathroom right now. You know, but we dab together. And I mean, from. Oh, yeah, I got one in my favorite food. Turkey is one of my favorite foods. Hey, hey, no, don't do that. You do not. You hear me? Where's your mom? Now you just lifted four favorite foods. I mean, where's your mom? It is it's all about foods that mashed potatoes and gravy. But you don't. Favorite food. You don't do that. Dressing and. Cranberry sauce. <laughs> but you don't do you don't go spin it on and on. And those are foods that today. If, if he did something, you tell his mom or something, but you don't spin it. Uh -huh. I could be here. Uh, okay. You know, it's, it's. Do you hear me? I haven't strayed too far from, Cause you from can those go home. memories and those moments uh -huh. of. You want to go home? Of the Thanksgiving yeah. holiday yeah. meals. Uh -huh. It's just the, huh? the turkeys, the hams, and. Um, they may be a corner to in. Oh, yeah. I'm asking you a question. Um, but what I did not name it, ended that position all the time. So okay. I just, it's making me realize I don't do enough veggies. Uh, uh, but the string beans. Yeah. Who is that? It's not a favorite food, but the little girl right there. Uh, oh, but I love greens. Any type holding of, a real. The uh, name of Yeah, Turn she up. just was spitting at y'all. Oh, no. Uh, I don't do that. Y'all need to stop. Okay, you need to take a time out. And sometimes. You know, back in the day when I was small, we had our greens and we would cut up tomatoes and put tomatoes and put tomatoes inside of the greens. You know, I've never been a house hot sauce person, but others did, but just a big bowl of greens. And I would start there. And then after I rest it a little bit, I go back to the rest. He got okay. And so now you started giving me a little bit of your green recipe. So what is your, how do you prepare your green? You know, um, I have, uh, in the last couple of years, I have learned to do my greens a little bit different. And so I started with a base of greens where I get my onions and my peppers and some garlic um, and a little olive oil. And I put that in the base of a big pot. Yeah. And I, I put that in the ground that gets the whole house aroma going. And I do that because I'm really good. And then I made a second for two for that. And I cook that for a little bit. Okay. And then I, after you clean your greens really, really good, uh -huh. uh, I began to add greens to the base. Oh, yeah. And I don't go get more Just go get more rest. Oh, okay. Because you want that season. Right. Right. The water just takes away from all the seasoning and it just prepared. And I add maybe uh, maybe a cup or two of chicken broth. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Kind of green. Because you know, green is really good. Exactly. Like cabbage yeah. does. And I just seal it at just like for a couple of hours. And really, it's hard. Oh, okay. You know, this is.
has actually been giving me an idea for something else at some point in time. We need to do a collard green cook-off. I've been getting so many good collard green recipes down here in yours. Yeah, we need to really thank Representative Moran for giving us her secret recipe now. I'm going to go out and make a million dollars from that recipe. No more sharing. Take that off of there. Thank you. Oh, absolutely. Right. Thank you for all, all right. you're doing. Cool. 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 Cool.